guys, that's the boy. We can turn me with another video, and I'm doing a video on how to get add-ons and texture packs for Windows 10, Apple, and uh, Pot and Android. Uh, so it's just for Pocket Edition and uh, Windows 10 Edition. So I'll have different parts of the video for each part. So one part for iOS, the other part for Windows 10, and the last part for Android. So I'll put it in the description, uh, the times for those. If you want to just skip to those times, unless you want to just watch all the tutorials. Uh, but in this part, I'm going to be talking about iOS. Uh, how to get add-ons for iOS. And the next part will be Windows 10. So for iOS, you're going to need to go to a website. I use MCPETL uh, to get add-ons, texture packs, and mods, and other things is what I use now. I don't really use any other website. You can use MCP Hub or MCP Universe, and I'll put links for all three websites in the description below. If you guys don't want to just type them in yourself, but I use MCPETL. I used to use the other two websites, but I just use MCPETL now. But I, you can use whatever one you prefer. I prefer MCPETL. So, yeah. So when you're going to a website to get an add-on, you're going to want to go to that add-on and then go down to the download area part of it and tap the download link and then once you've tapped the download link, it should open a new page, but you might have to tap something for it to open a new page. And I also have another video on how to get iOS texture packs uh, that you can go to uh, uh, and watch. So I'll have a link to that somewhere. Uh, but if you want to do it where you don't have to use a computer uh, for it, then just continue watching this. Uh, but for uh, iOS, it, uh, you go to that new page that it opens, or you have to tap something to open, and then it should say open in Minecraft PE, and also have the title of that thing. There should also be like a thing that looks like a page. Uh, so, so, yeah. Also, this thing, this guy right here, so broken. Anyway. So. Yeah, so then you tap open in Minecraft P, and then you should start opening in Minecraft and then importing the add-ons and mods and stuff, and then you'll be able to use the stuff, and yeah, and just use it for whatever world you want or do whatever you want. You use it once uh, it's imported it into it, you'll be able to use it. So, so that's the iOS part tutorial on how to get add-ons and texture packs for iOS. Uh, um, going to be showing how to get Windows 10, uh, add-ons and texture packs for the Windows 10 edition <laughs> of Minecraft. And then I'll, uh, do a tutorial, uh, then I'll show how to get add-ons for Android after that. So, I'll be right back once I'm on my laptop. Okay, so now I'm on my laptop to show you guys how to get... Uh, add-ons and texture packs for Windows 10. So as you can see, I'm on the MCPDL website. I'll put a link for it in the description below if you don't want to search it yourself. Uh, but this is the website I get my ma at my add-ons, mods, and texture packs from. I don't really use any other site to get texture packs and uh, free. Uh, add-ons and stuff from. I used to use other websites, but I don't really use them anymore. I use this uh, website. So, um, as you can see, we already there's add-ons and stuff showing. Uh, I'm going to show you guys how to get uh, the Pikachu add-on, which is on the second page. So, it's right here, and it's only for 1.0.0, but this also, this tutorial for Windows 10 works for all uh, oh, 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 wait, um, actually getting the, uh, not the Pikachu add-on, I'm getting, I'm going to be showing you guys how to get, the uh, the Finites at Freddy's Pets add-on. 
or I'm actually gonna show you guys how to get the Hydra add-on, which I'm gonna do. Uh, I'm gonna do a showcase on later. But uh, so if we scroll down on the website, as you can see, uh, this one has these two uh, links to click on to download it. Uh, if it's just a texture pack, then it will only have one thing to click on to get it. But if it's an add-on, it will have a behaviors pack and a resource pack. So you want to install both of them. So to get them, you want to click on one of them. And then it will click on that and then take you to at the place to download it. Sometimes, it, uh, so I went to the website to download it. Sometimes when you click on the link, it will just do already start downloading instead of having to load up some new page or whatever like mediafire or something but yeah so then it will uh you know download you gotta let it download uh download the specific one don't try don't accidentally download some fires or something but yeah so it will start downloading and stuff and uh as you can see i already have it downloaded it right here so if I click on it, uh, and this also works for the behavior packs, if I click on it, then it will, like, start loading into Windows 10, it will load up Windows 10, and if it doesn't show the Windows, uh, 10 picture there, then you'll have to, like, correct it and, uh, change it and open it into the actual one, so I'll be right back once I'm in Windows 10 with that, uh, with the add-on. Okay, so I'm in Windows 10 now, and I got the add-ons installed. Uh, so when you install an add-on for Pocket Edition and Windows 10 Edition, a little tab thing will uh, come pop up and uh, tell you that it's installing or it's sex successfully installed and stuff, which is uh, telling you just that it's installing and it finished and stuff. So if we go into a world uh i can show you guys the thing but except for i uh you have to actually put the add-on on you have to put the resource pack and behavior pack on so i'll be right back uh once i get out of this thing to show you guys okay so uh you want to you know add uh go into the thing so you can add the resource packs and the behavior packs and add those on and uh also, the picture for them might be like the same one for each one. I don't know why that happens. That happens for me on Windows 10. Not really sure. I'll probably find a look on how to fix that. Uh, it may happen to you guys too. And if I do find a fix to it, I'll put how to fix it in the description below or in the comments. So yeah. So I'm going to be doing a tutorial on how to get this. Uh, I'm going to not tutorial. I'm going to do a showcase on this uh, add-on uh, and i'll upload it today or tomorrow uh, probably but so yeah so once you're in you want to do what whatever it is that the uh, add-on does like changes or adds or whatever so this one replaces the iron golem so yeah this is the extra one and yeah that's how you get uh add-ons and texture packs on windows 10 uh, so I'll see you guys once um and once I'm on my uh, phone for the Android part of the tutorial. So I'll be right back once I'm there. Okay, so for Android, uh, you're going to need a file manager. You're going to need uh, Astro. You can use Astro File Manager or ES File Manager. I prefer Astro File Manager, but you can use either one. Uh, but I'm going to be using Astro File Manager in this video, so let's get started. So, when you download a uh, add-on for Android, you're going to want to, you know, download it, and then go into your File Manager and find your Downloads folder, uh, and then go into your file, uh, your Downloads file, uh, and then you're going to want to find the add-on or texture pack that you downloaded it will kind of look like paper uh so yeah so off okay so i you don't need to do this but i went into another folder to show you guys what it would look like if you're on android and you're going to 
uh, install an add-on or texture pack. So uh, if if it's a uh, like MCPE uh, pack or MC World uh, LAN that it says by the download and stuff, and that you tap, it should look it should look like those papers right there uh, next to that folder right there and then you want to like tap on it for whatever one you want and then once you tap on it it will start importing it into uh, minecraft so if i tap on the pikachu resource pack uh, i already have it installed so if you already have it installed it will say so once you import it to uh, pocket edition uh, then it will have a thing that shows, uh, like, that comes up saying, uh, importing it. But if you already have it installed, then it will say failed. Uh, but you can, like, delete it and stuff and then reinstall it. Uh, but, yeah, uh, so, when you install the stuff, they'll be in, like, your global resource pack thing. But also, uh, you can, like, go into your world and add resource packs and behavior packs. Uh, to it once you do that for Android and stuff. So yeah, this was a tutorial on how to install add-ons and texture packs for Pocket Edition and Windows 10 Edition. Uh, I also have another video probably on my channel somewhere for how to install texture packs for Android that aren't MC like Pack or MC World. Also, I have another tutorial for that on uh, iOS, but you don't have to do that way anymore because it's different, but you still can because uh, some things don't, some texture packs and like add-ons don't really work for iOS. But yeah, so uh, I have links to those stuff in the description. Uh, but if you wanted to use uh, tech, like uh, a, the add-on that I used in this video, I'll put a link to it in the description, but I also uh, did a showcase video on the Pikachu add-on, which I showed in this video. So, yeah. So, if you guys liked the video, then leave like and share this with your friends. And uh, hit that subscribe button if you're new here. And as always, guys, I'll see you in the next video. Bye!